viewers today latest update from ethiopia and tigray clashes viewers tigray defense forces seize weapons belonging to eritrean mercenaries viewers video posted recently shows tigray defense force fighters after capturing a largely intact ethiopian national defense force convoy at an unspecified location in the amhara region The Tigray Defense Force captured at least 3 T-72B1, 2 D-30 Howitzer, 2 trucks mounted ZU-23-2S and a bunch of trucks plus engineering equipment. Tigray forces paraded newly captured Ethiopian National Defense Force soldiers. Ethiopia could be on a path to state failure. 5 years ago, the Ethiopian army was the most powerful in the region. The fact it could not secure Tigray shows how quickly the situation has deteriorated. Viewers, according to Romia sources, Romo Liberation Army, it has been said they have put their hands in district of Volega region in Ume- Romia region. Romo Liberation Army is fighting against the government army in Oromia. Oromia region own districts that are not far from the Volega region of Nekemti. On the other hand, the Ethiopian army is using the residents of the Amhara region as human shields and placing their cannons next to the homes of civilians. Then they blame the Tigray forces for bombing civilians home the ethiopian government purchased the ak47 from south korea and it was transported by ethiopian airlines to addis ababa ethiopian airlines was directly involved in transporting soldiers and weapons to tigray during the tigray war international aviation agreements so we were this is the latest uh, update about it For more latest report please subscribe my youtube channel you can watch watch this video thanks for watching